हेलो एवरी वन वंस अगेन वेलकम टू पी एम नेटवर्किंग होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग ग्रेट गज टूडे इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन मोस्ट इम्पोर्टेंट सेनारियो बेस्ट नेटवर्क इंजीनियर इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन रिसेंटली वन ऑफ माई पेड स्टूडेंट रिसीव दिस क्वेश्चन इन इंटरव्यू एंड ही शेयर द क्वेश्चन विद मी एंड टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर सेम क्वेश्चन विथ यू गाइज इन दिस वीडियो सो इफ यू आर अ नेटवर्क इंजीनियर और इफ यू आर यू नो प्लानिंग टू बिकम अ नेटवर्क इंजीनियर मेक श्योर यू विल वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड बिकॉज इंटरव्यूअर कैन आस्क यू सेम क्वेश्चन टू यू ऑल्सो दिस इज वेरी कॉमन क्वेश्चन ऑफ बी जी पी very common question of bcp so what is question question is c interviewer asked him that i have three branches one is in ahmedabad one is in delhi and one is in mumbai one is in ahmedabad one is in delhi and one is in mumbai i have one server right in both location in ahmedabad and delhi right or you can say we have some network resource resource in ahmedabad location as well as in delhi location right he said i have one server in ahmedabad location and one server in delhi location with same ip address on this server let's say ip address is 192.168.10.1 here also 192.168.10.1 on both server we have configured same ip address now problem is whenever user from mumbai location is accessing server right router 3 means mumbai edge router router as are forwarding traffic towards delhi towards delhi but as you know from mumbai ahmedabad is near than delhi right so server 1 is nearest to mumbai location right so users in mumbai location should access server 1 not server 2 not server 2 so interviewer ask him how you will configure router number 3 so that mumbai users will access always server 1 right so that mumbai users will always access server 1 not server 2 how you will configure the scenario and he said you are allowed to use local preference right attribute to achieve this task so guys we will use local preference to achieve this task before that let me configure the scenario first because here i have not configured anything i am going to configure routers first i will configure ip addresses then i will enable bcp so guys here i i have access of all devices r1 on r1 i am going to configure first ip so interface serial 2/0 say no set and ip address over here it will be what uh 13.1.1.1 let's say i am using 13 network right exit interface f0/0 say no set and ip address here is let's say 192.168.10.100.255.255.255.0 fine this is ip configuration on router 1 let me configure ip on router number 2 also interface serial 2/0 seno set and ip address uh 23.1.1.2 let's say 255.255.255.0 exit interface f0/0 no set and ip address is 192.168.10.100.255.255.255.0 done i have configured ip on router number 2 also now let me take you to r3 on r3 interface serial 2/0 no set and ip address 13.1.1.3255.255.255.0 exit interface serial 2/1 again say no set and ip address 23.1.1.3 here 255.255.255.0 right no set so i have configured ip on all routers guys here i am going to run bgp as number 100 because you know interviewer can ask you that we have ebgp neighborship or ibgp neighborship between branches so here in delhi and ahmedabad router i am running bgp as number 100 on mumbai location i am running as number 200 or let's say 100 we are running same es number on all edge router right so let me do one thing as you know for ibgp neighbor how r3 will perform load balancing guys first of all it will check next hop then wait then attribute this will be same then we have self advertise attribute as path attribute origin code mat external over internal then igp cost to reach next hop so igp cost to reach next hop is also same right then it will uh, use oldest path in case of what in case of 
eBGP. But here, if we have iBGP, then it will check what lower neighbor router ID, right? Lower neighbor router ID. So let's say, let's say here we have eBGP neighborship 200, right? So best path selection will happen on the basis of oldest path. So I am going to configure BGP on router number three first. Say router BGP is number 200 and neighbor who is neighbor 13.1.1.1 and remote AS of this neighbor is what 100 and then we have one more neighbor neighbor 23.1.1.2 and remote AS of this neighbor is also what 100 right BGP configuration on router 3 is done now let me take you to R2 router 2 router BGP AS number 100 and say neighbor 23.1.1.3 and remote AS of neighbor is what 200 and then I am going to advertise one network 192.168.10.0 and mask 255.255.255.0 done now on router number 3 if you will verify bgp table so ip bgp you can see soon router 3 will learn 192 prefix on router number 2 so ip bgp here you can see it have installed this prefix in bgp table it will take some time after that this prefix will become best then it will advertise to router number 3 so ip interface brief 192.160.10. Correct. So IP BGP. It's taking time, right? Now you can see this prefix is best. So on router number three, also you can check BGP table. So IP BGP. So we have this network, right? Via 23.1.1. Two. Now I am going to configure BGP on router number one. Say, say router BGP as number 100 and neighbor 13.1.1.3 and remote AS is 200. Then I am going to advertise against this network command network mask 255.255.255.0. Now router one will also advertise this network to router number three to Mumbai location. Now let me take you to R3 and let me show you BGP table. So IP BGP. It have not received prefix from router number one till now. Just wait for some time. After some time, we will have one, uh, you know, same network from router number one also. So IP BGP. Okay, on router number three. Now you can see. Right, and guys, by default, best is via which router? Best is via router number one. Why best is via router number one? Because of lower neighbor router id because of lower neighbor router id so if i will configure router id higher router id on router number one let me do one thing on router number one i'm going to configure higher router id router bgp 100 and say bgp router router id let's say 10.10.10.10 .10 .10 .10. and on router number two router bgp s number 100 and say bgp router id let's say 5.5.5.5.5.5 .5 .5 now on r3 i am going to clear ip bgp star soft in now you can see so ip bgp wait so ip bgp it will take some time so ip bgp done so ip bgp Done soon it will receive same prefix from router number one also. Wait on R1. So IP BGP done. Now you can see we have two paths and best is via router number two now from Delhi location. So now if Mumbai user here, if I will create one loopback interface loopback one and say IP address on this loopback is IP address on this loopback is 10.10.10. .10 .10. Let's say 255 255 255 dot 255, right? And I am going to advertise this network in BGP. So router BGP is yes, number 200 here and say network 10.10.10.10 .10 .10 and mask 255 255 255 .255. Now can I ping? 192.168.10.100 so yes i am able to ping if i will trace route 
192.168.10.100 and say numeric so you can see traffic is going via Delhi or via router number 2 so now these LAN user are accessing server 2 but uh, interviewer can ask you how you will configure R3 so that Mumbai user should access server 1 right and you are allowed to change local preference value right so now best path is so IP route BGP in the routing table you can see next hop is IP address of router 2 right but next hop should be what IP address of router 1 so what I am going to do I am going to create one route map to perform my lamp so to interviewer also you need to say what I need to create one route map and we need to add local preference value let's say route map name is what Cisco and sequence number 10 here I am going to say set local preference value what 110 or any any value you can set right now so IP BGP by default you can see local preference value from both neighbor is 0 right now on router number 3 I am going to call this route map with router 1 so say router BGP AS number 200 and say neighbor what neighbor 13.1.1.1 and use route map route map in which direction in in direction route map name each Cisco in which direction in in direction fine and now again clear IP BGP star shop in now so IP BGP now you can see guys this network is best via router number one again if you will trace route 192.168.10.100 so you can see this time my traffic is hitting to Ahmedabad router right and so IP BGP you can see why because of local preference value local preference value from this neighbor is 110 and local preference value from local preference value for, from this neighbor is zero right so this is how you can configure the scenario so that Mumbai users should access server one okay guys so this is interview question maybe interviewer can ask you this question you know in next time in next interview to you so you can answer right to interviewer how you will configure local preference that's all guys for today if you have learned something from this video please hit on like button we will meet soon in next video till then stay safe bye bye thanks for watching